wedding going on right now. Check this out. driving in the UK is being on the right hand side of the car. And I'm going to ask you a question, a question that I asked you almost 20 years ago. How do you feel? <laughs> Scared. <laughs> I don't think that's what you said 20 years ago. I can't remember what you said now, but that wasn't that. It was something else. Well, it's just keep trying to kiss the curve on the left hand side of the vehicle because you know what's really weird this mirror you, I go to look to the right for the rear view mirror but it's on the left it's bizarro making it work though big trucks here too. we're in Falkirk and we're at the Kelpies we're at that Kelpies these are the little ones right behind us. Check these out. It's starting to sprinkle a penny bit. It is sprinkling a little bit. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. But we're going to go see the big ones now. The Kelpies are actually 30 meters tall. And these two horses are super cool. They're part of the Helix. The Helix is a really cool place to check out. And what was amazing to us is how the weather changed. Look how the sky cleared up. It started off really gray and became partly cloudy and then suddenly became sunny, which is kind of typical of Scotland. You'll get four seasons in one day. Man, these things are amazing. I'm so glad I flew them. There's Chuck. He just put his drone away because there's a helicopter going by. Hey, so I saw that moving, but I don't really understand how that works. It's a lot. I know, but is that a boat up there? Yeah. But why did it seem like it turned down and went back up and... It rotates to take from this, it goes from this level of the canal up high. It rotates. It's badass. <laughs> okay. It's called the wheel. I was so excited to see the Falkirk wheel in person because as a mechanical engineer, this this lock just blows my mind. The way that it can rotate and raise and lower the boats from the top canal to the lower canal. It, it, it's There's so much great engineering in Scotland and this is just a tribute to their 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 brilliance it's just brilliant the windmills are cool too way up there it's the an hill. engineering marvel you ever see the windmills up in the hill they're cool yeah the lock's cooler than the windmills. engineering marvel I seriously could have sat there and watched this all day but we had to move on because we had a castle to get to We've arrived at the Donick Hotel. This place is kind of cool too. That's where we stand. I'm sure we'll get it in the daytime too. We absolutely love this room. The huge four-poster bed with the wood top and the castle wall surrounding us with the backlighting just made it so cozy and inviting. And then this desk was great for laying out all my drone stuff actually just having things charging up and going but it's just so stately and, and yet cozy and then the bathroom the bathroom had this incredible jet tub which was really welcoming after a long day of walking around and vlogging and then the shower was really nice as well so we really 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 enjoyed this space a lot and hope to come back again soon but then there's the castle itself which is just 
well, ridiculous. I mean, look how cool the views are. But let's go back inside, because it's time for us to grab a bite to eat. So, Lori's about to try... <laughs> what are they called? Um, they're... Are they haggis? Thumbnails? Yeah. I think they're haggis bonbons. Haggis bonbons. That's what we're gonna do right now. I was dared by Keith to do haggis, but maybe this is like breaking haggis. You're gonna go first? I don't think he. I don't think he bargained on this. Okay, you go first. Stuck together. Hold on. Okay. Get in there. All right, you have the sauce too. Yeah, but I think I'm gonna cut it in half. I'm gonna try. Okay. So You're really dragging this out. A little bit. It's very warm too. Maybe I'll just cut a little bit. Maybe I'll dip it. All right, you dip it. All right, go for it. So what's the verdict? Tastes like chicken. Tastes like chicken, she says. No, I'm kidding. Um, actually, I don't know how to describe it. It's, um, it's not bad. So. All right, it's my turn. Alright, here we go. I'm just gonna grab them. Grab them like this. <laughs> Dip it in the sauce. And tell me what you think it tastes like. Alright, here we go. And don't say chicken. It's hard to describe. It's not bad, but how do you describe it? It tastes... No, we don't say chicken. Like... No. Meatloaf. Meat, <laughs> meat cake. It's meat cake. Is it meat? Is it cake? Smell it. It has no smell whatsoever. It's good. It's smoky kind of. Smoky? It's a little bit. It's not, I mean, it has a, little, it has a crunchy coating. I can't really just... It's bizarre. I need more sauce. I was gonna say it's not bad though. Double dipping. It's not bad. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's different. You happy, Keith? <laughs> it's our second night in Scotland and Donna Castle left us some really nice single malt scotch so I think we, we should a, pour it. Give it a try? Yeah. That's what cute, I think. Cute little glasses. More for me. And I have to say I love the third place. Raise a glass to our second night in Scotland. And also to our 20th anniversary. A little late. But still. Okay. Cheers. Oh my God, that's good. <laughs> oh my God, that's good. <laughs> that's good. It's pretty good. I hate to say I scotch drinker, I guess. <laughs> it's smooth. That's good scotch. Pack your bag and join us next time as we head to the most haunted cemetery in Scotland. It's a Halloween special you're not going to want to miss. So we'll see you then. <laughs>